Hi, my name is Tanya Batts and I'm an instructor at Gold's Gym. I want to show you a few exercises that, abdominal exercises that you can do for older adults. Okay, so I'm going to come on down. Simple way to start. Old fashioned crunch is good stuff. Fingertips on the head. Think of a tennis ball or an apple between your chin and your chest. Lift and lower. Elbows are wide here. You want to squeeze the belly like someone's going to hit you in the stomach. What do you do? Squeeze. Squeeze. That's three. That's two. That's one. So every time I do this, I'm pushing my low back into the floor. Okay? Another one's pretty fun. It's called the bug, and I like it. Cross the ankles. Your head is on the floor. Kind of open the knees wide. Fingertips are going to come on your head. We're lifting off. You want to move your hips kind of like Elvis. Your hips back and forth. Then add the upper body in. It kind of resembles a bug on its back trying to get up. He's kind of stuck. So you're going to feel this on your sides. You can just move the hips if you don't want to add the upper body in. But this one's fun and it really works kind of everything. It's pretty amazing. Another one, wood chops. The feet are flat. I want you to extend your left leg long. Your right arm is going to be way over your head. Left fingertips are on your head to protect the neck. And I'm going to chop to the outside of my thigh. So chop. So the arm and leg are long, chop. And again, you're going to feel this on your side. The low back is on the floor. There is no tension in the neck. And this is pretty amazing. I'm feeling it as I lift and the fact that I've got my arm kind of crossing over to the outside of the thigh is pretty good stuff. Okay, so those are three fairly simple exercises that anybody can do. I mean, young or old. So get on the floor, get going, get that strong core. It's gonna give you great posture and that's what you can do for your core.